All right, fellas, today I'm going to give you a few outfit ideas that you can wear this summer on a date. What's good, y'all? Steve from the Dapper Aristocrat, where every week we give you tips on how to look good, stand out, and get those compliments. So MRI man suggested that I do a topic looking at dating at night. Hey man, I was gonna suggest that topic, but I guess he beat me to it. Yeah, right, Joe, you a hater. So I decided to give you guys a more broader array of outfits, and these outfit ideas can go from dates that can happen in the morning to even in the evening time. So I'm gonna break down these outfits based on casual to semi-casual to formal. So the first casual outfit we'll look at is denim shorts with a nice polo. Now this polo I picked up from J. Crew, and what I liked about it is that it wasn't too long. These denim shorts are also great because they got a little bit of a distressed look, but at the same time, it's not too over the top with holes and stuff like that. It's still a nice clean look, but it also has a little bit of spice to it. Shorts may be a little longer, it goes past my knee, so instead of wearing them just like they are, I rolled the short leg up so it gives it more of a shorter appearance. That way my outfit is well proportioned. With this outfit, I paired a nice pair of Nike Kill Shocks, but you can go with any type of sneaker, whatever you prefer. I prefer a low top sneaker because I think they look great with shorts. Any shoe will work like a low top Chuck Taylor, Van Old School, or even any type of Van Casual canvas sneaker works great with this outfit. You can also change your polo out for a nice t-shirt. No logos, no crazy sayings, not on no date. Yo, what kind of shirt you got on right now? Come on, bro. I'm at home, man. I ain't on no date. You just want to keep it simple. And I really like this outfit because it's very simple and it's very casual. It works in situations when you're going for a walk in the park, lunch, breakfast, just something simple that you would do. Now, the next few looks are more of a semi-casual look. So the first outfit is one of my favorite looks, and that is pairing a nice button-up shirt with a nice pair of chinos. Got chosen a very bright, very vibrant color chino. And my shirt is a darker color, it's navy, where the pattern is a floral print that's outlined in pink. So it kind of plays off the pink in my pants and it matches up very well. The next look is more bolder. And this is a look for those guys that are more confident, not too afraid to experiment with accessories. So I went with a pair of nice white chinos, a button up shirt with a floral print and a nice fedora hat. Now the fedora hat makes the outfit look great. You can go with or without a fedora. It's your choice. It plays on the color of my shirt and it goes well with the white chinos. Now I could have went with a loafer or a driver. I figured, hey, I might as well wear a nice pair of wingtip brogues. I just picked these up from Becky Semini and I was dying to wear them and it worked out very well with this outfit. So if you like these shoes, I have a link in the description below and it gives you 10% off your first purchase. Bro, I'm clumsy. I ain't trying to take no L and O dress shoes. That's embarrassing. The type of shoes that you choose is based on what you feel in and what you have in your collection. So these shoes I picked up from Tav and they make a huge statement. They're very bold. They have a floral print on them. They make the outfit look amazing. Women really like guys that wear nice clean shoes that look great. So a great option for you guys in the summer. Now don't forget about a vest. A vest is a great thing to utilize on a date in the summertime. Pretty semi-casual, but you can also make it formal too, especially if you're a guy that doesn't enjoy wearing suits. Bro, I ain't trying to wear no pants. I'm trying to show off my hard work. Hard work? Bro, you know I'm skipped on leg days. Instead of wearing pants, you can choose a nice pair of casual shorts. Now you can go with chino shorts, or you can go with linen shorts, which is what I have in this look. It's great for a nice summer day, especially if you go on a brunch with your love interest. Again, this is a nice summer look. Definitely going to be cool. And it's a great look, especially in the summertime. Now let's get into formal looks. And formal looks are mainly for guys that are going out with their significant other, whether they got a nice wedding to go to, graduation, going to meet the parents at church. The thing that you want to keep in mind is that it's hot outside. You want to go with clothing that is light, that is breathable. You don't want to go with a nice wool suit because wool is made for fall and winter. Instead of wearing a wool suit, go with a suit that's breathable, that's light, like polyester, cotton, chambray, linen, or seersucker. Hey, bro, give me something else because a whole suit 
That ain't really my thing. When it's a hot day, you wanna go with something light. So in this look, you see me with a light blazer, a button up shirt with polka dots, orange pair of chinos, and I had to hit it off with a nice bow tie. A bow tie? Who gonna tie that? I actually did a video that shows you how to tie it. If you guys are interested, I'll leave a link in the description below. Every color that I have on is also on my bow tie as well. I chose a Chelsea boot, but in the summertime, there's so many variety of shoes that you can choose from, from a loafer, brown wingtip bro, but go with something that you're comfortable with, something that you have in your wardrobe, and something that makes you stand out and look good for that love interest. Once you see that you dress good, and you got a bomb personality that she loves, you're gonna hit the jackpot, and she's gonna be ready to go on the next date or maybe get married. Married? Did you know you got a wedding ring on? <laughs> oh, who knows? Let me know what your favorite outfit was in the comment section below. Shout out to MRI, man, for suggesting this topic. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like button because it helps support my channel. Shout out to all my Dappercrats out there. Always remember to be a gentleman, stay dapper, and I'll see you guys next video.